Hey everybody, a very casual vlog type video today and we haven't done a movie couple eats in a minute. The last yep. time we did was for Lunar New Year at Universal? No, I no. think it was the taste. It was the um, California Adventures uh, Sip and Savor. Oh, that's right. Okay, so, oh, which we might have to go back because they just started their food and wine Ooh. festival and I was looking through the menu last night because I couldn't sleep and oh my God, it looks so good. <laughs> and I'm going on a, on a tangent. That's not what we're here to talk about today. We we're are going to talk, talk about, about 85 degrees, baby. <laughs> 85 degrees is a uh, Asian bakery. They have coffee and tea, milk teas, and all these like super cute really pastries, cakes, and things like that. There's one that's right next to our house. And I have become obsessed and I go all the time. But they have um, two new things. They have a fresh strawberry milk tea. And you can see on the bottom that's all the fresh strawberry there. Uh, and, and he's shaken his up already. But the one thing that really got me was a uh, boba lava cake. And in the picture it looked fantastic. We're going to open it because I really don't know what I bought. Except that <laughs> it's a cake with like boba on top. I don't know. We're going to figure it out. The moment of truth has arrived. What if it's ugly? Oh my gosh, I'm gonna be so disappointed if it's... Well, mm. it's not the cutest. Kinda mushy. But it's not like it's not... hideous. Oh, it's the as cream. soon as we remove it, everything's gonna go ah, okay. And that's what it's designed to do, probably. Okay. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> it's a little messy. Hmm. It's a little messy. Uh, I'm gonna a, go it, ahead it, and it's that cheese foam on top. Take huh? the cream and taste it with a boba. Huh. That's interesting. So the foam, like Dustin said, is a little cheese foam. Tastes much better with a boba on it. Hmm. Mm. You're not sure? I think the cheese it, it's good it's the cheese foam is good. Okay. But it's weird. With, it, it's that salty, sweet kind of mixture, um, and I think at first I didn't don't like it, but I'm gonna try it again. Okay. Moment of truth. We're gonna cut into this and take a bite of it all together. All right. The boba keeps the boba keeps falling off my cake slice. Here we go. Yeah, you're right. It's interesting. There's a lot in that. Mm. Mm -hmm. I feel like that meme of that one girl. She was like, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm. I kind of feel like that meme. So the cake itself is very good. I like mm -hmm. the cake. It's got like a little bit of a chocolate slash espresso kind of a feel to it mm -hmm. in the flavoring. And it's very spongy. But then I don't know if the foam or the cream and the boba really quite go together. Like I don't think so either. It hasn't really moistened through. So I don't. This I might say, be it's a weird, but it's bit. not bad. It's very. It's definitely a different kind of um, cake that I was kind of anticipating. Yeah. And it, I think the cheesiness of the foam. The middle tastes much better. Oh, the middle. Oh, it does. Because it's it's more. You guys can see in the middle. It's a different color, so it's a little bit more wet, if you will. Yeah, the cake is actually the cake is actually really, really good, good on its own. I'm trying to put all the boba but, back. <laughs> Get back on top, boba. I will say this right now. I was very, very excited about this, even though I had no idea what kind of a flavor I was going to um, be putting in my mouth. <laughs> now that I've tried it, I can confidently say that this will be the last time I get the lava cake. Mm -hmm. It's not that it's expensive or anything like that. It's just, it's like- There's other things that we'd much rather get that we enjoy a lot more. <laughs> Agree. So kind of thing. I think this there's would, that. I think this would hit for a very particular kind of palette overall. But for, I think for like the general public, they're gonna be a little thrown off by the cheese. Um, I think they if they would have used like maybe like a sweet foam yeah, or like a milk tea foam or, or milk, some, something actually, like yeah. that. I think that probably would have worked yeah. really well as a milk tea foam to actually get a little bit more of a sweeter, mm -hmm. then it kind of all goes together. The 
Yeah, the, the cheese foam just really threw me off. Still throws me off every time I bite into it. It doesn't really combine with the other flavors well. Mm -hmm. Um, so with that said, we're going to move on to our fresh strawberry milk tea. Dustin's already shaking his up. I'm going to do mine now. The guy said to shake it up before we drink it, so we'll shake it. And we didn't get any uh, boba with it this time because we were already getting boba on the cake. Mm -hmm. And plus, so. we've had you know boba in our drinks a lot of times before. So I, this time, it's like we just want to focus on just the drink. <laughs> I like the fact that the, I stab it right on the edge, and Wendy goes right smack dab for the middle. <laughs> That was actually, I wasn't even aiming. Normally, my stab is way off. Oh, but yeah, you you hit a bullseye on that one. It's it's very bland. What? I thought there was, the strawberry flavor was going to be really a lot stronger, but it's, well, maybe bland's the wrong word. Because it has kind of like a negative connotation. It's very, um... <laughs> Here, take another sip and gather your thoughts. No, even, I think actually bland's probably the, the right word for this. Is that your final answer? Okay, I'm going to give it a try. Because it doesn't quite taste like milk tea. Yeah, I get what you're saying. Okay, bland is not a bad word to use because the strawberry flavor is not really present, even though we saw how much strawberry was on the bottom of this. But now we blend it all together. I can't taste the strawberry nor the milk tea, which is weird. Like I can't, the, the flavors canceled each other out and I can't really taste anything even though I'm getting like strawberry bits. Like yeah. I just, I just got a giant chunk of strawberry. Interesting. Hmm. But like, I, like I once again, strawberry I milk tea, that's bad. Like if I got this, as, I'm like, oh, let's try out this instead of my usual. I would have been like, oh, I like my usual better, but I'm not like, oh my gosh, this is not good kind of a thing. I'm slightly disappointed in both. Mm -hmm. I was very excited about the lava cake specifically because it looked so fun. And now I'm just like, mm, meh. meh. Luckily, we have a ton of other pastries that we're going to indulge yeah. in. And we know those are good because we've had them before. Anyways, <laughs> that is our quick bites. What are we, what are we calling this? Um, bite, bite size. Bite size. Movie couple eats bite size. Hope you guys enjoy. It's been fun doing this. Short little video. If you like to see shorter bits of these kind of videos, let us know in the comment section below. And um, we always like to take suggestions on what you guys want us to try next. Keep in mind that we live in LA. So if you have somewhere that's really, really great, but it's in New York, we are probably not going to get to do it unless we're in New York for <laughs> something. So just keep that in mind. All right, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and we will see you in the next video.